First we'll start with taking out the top cover, undoing the three clamps, removing the hose off the HEPA covers, rotating the lid so it's out of your way, removing the thumb nuts off the HEPA cover, Remove all three HEPA covers and HEPA filters. Yeah. We are getting down into changing the soft start and the electronical filter. On an S36. Three Allen screws hold the HEPA cover on, or the engine cover on. One on each side, one on the back. The gaskets are very tight around the engine tube, so a light spray of soapy water or a Windex helps it to easily get off. Pull the cover right off, and now you're ready to take the red housing off. Now we're going to be removing the red cover to get to the soft start and the electronic filter. We'll start by removing the Allen head screws all the way around the red housing. Next, we will remove the black cover off of the front. Now we're going to be removing the red cover to get to the soft start and the electronic filter. We'll start by removing the Allen head screws all the way around the red housing. Next, we will remove the black cover off of the front. Now in order to get the rest of the cover off, we have to disconnect the manometer and the on-off switch. So we will slightly pull it back, take off the manometer tube, 
cut your zip tie holding all your wires together. Disconnect your wires off your on off switch. You also need to lean down and get to the ground wires that are disconnect that are connected down to the housing. Take a se seven millimeter wrench. Undo the nuts. There's a total of five nuts. And Now that all your ground wires are off, you can lift your housing up and off and get the housing out of the way. As you can see now, you can easily access your soft start that's riveted to the bottom of the chariot as well as your electronical filter. We now need to disconnect the electronical filter and break the rivet on the soft start. There is a nut on the bottom of the electronical filter. Grab it with a wrench and slightly twist it with your hand and it unscrews. To remove the soft start, use a hammer and a flathead screwdriver to break the rivet. If need be, we have wiring diagrams on our website that will show you how to correctly wire the soft start and the electronical filter back together. If not, we can always take photos before we go disconnecting any wires. The easiest way to remove the soft start when you're in the field is to simply cut off the soft start. You will later on adjust the sizes of the wires to accommodate the lengths that you need and splice them back together. Now we have removed the electronical filter and the soft start quick and easy without having to disassemble all the engine tubes and the engines and so forth and so on. Now we're going to reinstall the electronical filter and the soft start. I have pre-cut the wires to go back in accordance and crimped on a new quick connect terminal. The soft start comes with a rivet, but when you're in the field and don't have a rivet gun, it can be easily placed back in with a screw and a locking nut. You will also need a very small Phillips to get inside here. Now you're ready to crimp, crimp your wires back on.
strip your blue wire and your black wire that was to your soft start crimp it back to the blue wire and black to the black wire of your new soft start You have now installed your soft start correctly back with the correct wires. And you are now ready to install your electronical filter. You'll see that there is a ground symbol. Connect a small ground wire back on the ground side. You receive a nut and a washer. Place the washer first, then the nut, and tighten it down. You'll notice on the electronical filter, there is numbers. Number one and two is brown number three and four is blue the number four takes the double blue wire the number three takes the single wire going up to your on off switch the long brown wire going up to your on off switch goes to number one The brown wire from the soft start goes to number two. You are now ready to put your housing back on. You have successfully put in an electronical filter and a soft start.